What's up everybody? Um, it's the Virginia Survivor here with a new video and um today we're gonna be talking about squirrel calls. Now, I'm a big fan of uh squirrel hunting and I like squirrels and they're I like their meat. I cut cut them in half, you know, throw them on the grill. That's um that's amazing. Kinda tastes like chicken. Um of course everything does. There's a fly in here. Oh shoot, I actually hit it. Um um it's good luck, I guess. But anyways, squirrel calls. And now, I never really realized there was a squirrel call until my dad got it for me for Christmas. I got this for Christmas. Um, so I'll show it to you in depth. Um, yeah, there's a tail. It's got four, I don't know, little, like, ring things. And there is a, oh, sorry. I just had a frame, wasn't it? I was looking at, it's got four ring things along the top. And it's got a wooden piece here. And it has a, a little, um like whistle type thing but like we'll get to that in a second so this is some kind of um right here it's a, just like some kind of flexible rubber and these do look like they're handmade um they do look like it here's the there's a little sticker on here that got covered up just a little bit but it's um what's it say four way squirrel call so how to use one of these four way squirrel calls well there's a couple different ways now this is this is one of them. Okay, this is a baby squirrel or squirrel in distress or something like that. I forgot. But anyways, you do this. That that's like a squirrel in distress or something like that. Um, or baby, <laughs> I forgot by now. But that's what it is, and that's what it sounds like. I give it to we. I give it to you again. There you go. Hopefully you can hear that. Or hopefully it's not too sharp. Um, so yeah, and here's another one. Now this one, I'm going to put my hand like this, but I'm not going to fully like put my palm on it. I'm going to give it a little bit of room. Maybe you can see this. Yeah. Grab the knot. I'm just doing this. And here it goes. And I, don't know, I forgot what kind of squirrel that is. Um, I had this like this piece of paper that had them. Honestly, I just threw it away. I figured, you know, I just, I don't know, I'll just try it, see what happens. So yeah, and here's another one. Now I don't want this one. I don't know. It sounds like a duck to me, but apparently it's some kind of squirrel. I only usually um, shoot gray squirrels. Don't usually see any fox squirrels, but something like that. I guess you can do it this way too. Um, so you've got one, two, three. What was the fourth one again? Jesus, I haven't done this in a long time. I can't remember, but that's how you get. I mean, I, I I just found this thing. It was in it's in my closet because I got this at the very end of squirrel season, and I and I put it my, away in my stuff and just. Forgot about it. It's you know it's deer season here soon, so you got squirrel season. Uh, pretty soon after that. Um, well, actually, I haven't even checked the schedule this year, but pretty sure squirrel season's after that, like last year. And um, I'm gonna be shooting some squirrels. I'll show you some of my some of my game that I caught. Maybe. So yeah, it's the uh, squirrel call which I will be trying to use this year. Squirrel hunting. So there you go. See you guys later. Make sure to subscribe, comment, like, do all that stuff. Um, give me on Twitter. Follow me. I don't really post anything. Um, so, there you go.